Oh, something early, something early. Tuscan. Tuscan fear, Tuscan. maybe? Fear. Uh, fear is that same thing where I hear like a dated version of myself, you know? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I could have rapped that better. Um, yeah. yeah, I don't know. The fifth one, shit. I got a lot of songs. So, so what, went, the, but what went wrong with Tyler, man, at the Camp Flog Nog, man? <laughs> um, I, I, just walk, I just walked myself into a situation. I kind of felt it backstage, too. I kept making jokes. I think I actually made a joke on camera. Someone showed me the clip the other day. I'm like, how long do you think it's going to take before they boo me off stage? <laughs> <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, I, it I just... More, it was more jeering and trolling, I yeah, feel. Yeah, I actual think, no, it was, it was booing. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I have my. I tried to listen to one. It was a, it was a clip where you was like, "What the hell?" I'm performing the hit, and it's like it's not connected. Nah, it was no, just you look really befuddled at times. You was like, "I was, I was a little." Is someone fucking with me? Like, what is, what is going on? I was a little, I was a little confused because I just didn't, like, I was kind of sitting there going, like, "You guys know Frank's not here, right?" So it's yeah. like. You may as well just like get over that and rock. now like let's rock because like I'm the guy, I'm the replacement. So we you know, I got a couple joints if you want to hear them. Like it was I actually now in hindsight wish I would have said like, yo guys, no Frank, Frank Ocean, or just like been like yeah. broke out into like a tornado and just made everything. <laughs> Those are like the two like re biggest regrets of my life, I wish I um, but yeah, I, I, I just walked myself into a situation that, like, you know, people thought they were coming to a Frank Ocean concert. That yeah. was what everyone yeah. was there for. And, like, you know, it's been, that festival's been on for eight years and he hasn't come once and they thought this was the year and, and it wasn't. Right. So I they got... I Tyler they, was really upset. Yeah, I think... Put you in that position. Well, know? I think Tyler was upset. I, I got a lot of, you know, me and Tyler have a lot of respect for each other, a lot of love for each other. And... You know, I think he went out on a whim asking me to, to do this, and I had to change my schedule around for it. And um, I, um, yeah, I just, I, I, think he, I think he thought it was going to go over really well, uh, especially, like, you know, like, Feel No Ways and Wu-Tang Forever were, like, his, no his requests. Put Feel No Ways there. That's number five. Oh, yeah, that there is number go. five, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Feel No Ways and, and, um, and, and Wu-Tang were his requests, and yeah. I think he just thought, like everyone's gonna love this as much as me, mm. and um, yeah, they just. That's when you lost the crowd a little bit. Yeah, yeah I, it, they were just they, they were out of it from yeah, they yeah. were out of it from Uzi's second song. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. they were already like Rocky came out, yeah. and yeah, you can bring it. And Rocky came out, and Tyler and Rocky are like brothers, so people are excited to see Rocky because he's like part of the you know golf Wang family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then Uzi came out. And they showed him love, and then he tried to do a second song, and they did not show love on that second mm -hmm. song. That was when I got worried. I was yeah. like, oh, shit, they're not shooting. Mm -hmm. yeah. And he hit the shoulder move, and they, just, <laughs> they, they, didn't, they didn't respect they, the shoulder they move. They didn't fuck with the shoulder move. I was oh, like, oh, man. this is crazy. And then I came out, and like the first song or two was, was good. They were going off. But at the end of the day, I just I knew right away. I'm like, they, they came to see a different show. Yeah. Yeah. And it didn't matter who walked out, I don't think. They right. wanted to see their guy. And so, you know, and it was like 2,000 people out of like yeah. 50,000 or whatever, 30,000. But it, it had an impact enough for me to be like, I walked off stage. Like, my next songs were about to slap the place. Like, I had like nonstop, <laughs> yeah. sicko, uh, God's plan. I had a bunch of joints to still do. Um, you Money in the Grave I was going to do. But yeah, it just... I just had to cut because I was like, you know, this could this could go really bad. Where if I over, I've already overstayed my welcome. Yeah. If somebody throws something and hits me, or like if this just mm, if this yeah. really if this tide starts to turn even more, I already knew I was I already knew I was the talk of the the, the yeah. gram for like the next two days. Mm -hmm. So I was like, let me just. But does it fire you up like the competitive nature of you? Like no matter what, I mean, you understand the circumstances, but just like that, no matter how much success, people can still try to doubt on you one time, right? Like no matter what. Yeah, that's that's a really tough group of 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 kids to make happy, though. You know, like yeah, yeah. Um, it's just like a really like it's a cult. It's a cult following. Yeah. You know, Tyler has built like a cult and. It's a tough, it's a tough group to, um, to, to make, to make happy. So, uh, yeah, I just took it with grace. It was a nice yeah, moment yeah. of humility. Um, I could have, you, you know, I, I, I remember, I remember like, you know, I would, I remember old Wayne shows where like one person would be like, oh, crazy. yell while he's talking and he'd be like, fuck this, bro. <laughs> and like throw the mic and dip. And I was thinking like, ah, oh, should I pull the wheezy baby one time and just go, but nah, it was, it was, it was all good, you know. Um, 
It was, it was, it was, it was important for me. Um, would I do a B side show? Yeah, sure. I would, I would love to do like, we've, we've talked about maybe doing an unplugged, um, with, with, with all the records that like I never usually perform. I think it would be great. I think it would also just showcase how serious I take performing as well. I think majority of the time, uh, people see me as on like shaky cell phone cameras and arenas. (laughs) And I think it would be nice to have an intimate moment. Um, but sorry, what I was going to say about the, the flog knot thing was, um, it's funny, I feel like it builds up the story because I feel like maybe, you know, when a, it, when a new album drops, I feel like maybe next year they might be, they might be calling for me, you know? You never know. <laughs> I'm serious. That's how it is. Sometimes the story just needed to go like that. Sometimes, yeah, yeah. you know, next year, because that could be the moment where, you know, I pop out and, it's, and, they, and they, you know, it's only a thousand people. Bro. Right. The story went nice for you in sports, man. You, I feel like you won an NBA championship. Yeah, that as was as much as anybody. Like, what did that? I mean, I saw you go crazy after that game five win, where you was really like letting the people know the passion of the city. Like, what would, yeah, what I personally, was, I, I, what was that experience like? I'm for be you? honest with you guys, I was, I was drunk. <laughs> um, but, uh, this but that's this, this didn't exist. Right here. <laughs> no, but that is true though. <laughs> that is true. Yeah. But I, I pretty much have zero recollection of, of, of how I pieced like that, piece that like speech that. together. <laughs> But it was a surreal you had moment. A press conference. Yeah. You called the press conference. I know. Yeah, I, I was just natural. It was a, again. It was organic. I just turned to my right, and there was thirty <laughs> microphones. They wanted to hear me speak. Um, but no, it was. It was. That was like one of the. You know, you talk about not realizing how crazy something was until like it's all calmed down. Yeah. Um, that 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 entire playoffs and. Uh, you know, building that like that connection with Kawhi. Obviously, I've been friends with Kyle for years and years, and you know, all all the rest of the guys that have been playing their heart out on this team, even when we were not doing well. Um, but that that parade, I've, I've I've honestly never seen anything like that with my two eyes in my entire life. I've never been so sure that something wasn't real, mm. like. I was like, this is not real. I must be like, I must have like, you know, dislocated my knee and I'm like in the hospital on like 